Hello, my name is Luis Benitez and I want to show you a quick tip on how to take your IBM Connections files offline on your mobile device. The first thing that you want to do is download an app called Fresh Talks. And Fresh Talks is, is a free app from the App Store and you can use your iPhone or your iPad or even iPod Touch to download this app. Once you do that and you install it on your iOS device, you want to go into the Settings section. So go into Settings, Find Fresh Talks, and then from there you want to go and set up some of the um, settings there or preferences such as your username, your password, and of course the host name to your connection server. It's, this is going to use CMIS, and I'm not going to get into the details as to what CMIS is, but if you want to learn more, just go out to my blog. Now I'm going to click on the Home button here for my iPhone, and then once I do that, I'm going to click on the Files section here and look for the Fresh Talks app, and here it is. So I'm going to click here, and this is going to load. And after a couple of seconds, notice that I can now have access to all of my files or even all of my folders within IBM Connections. So I'm going to click on Files, and it's going to retrieve the list of uh, files from the server, and there it is. So very easy, very well done. I can now see all of the files. I'm going to click on the very first file here to open it, and it's going to take a couple of seconds to load. This one is a 2 megabyte file, and uh, it took about, about 5 seconds to load on my iOS device. And there you have it. it uh, this is coming from Microsoft Office, but of course it supports uh, you know any file coming from iWork or any other uh, productivity suite. I'm going to click on the share icon just to give you a sense as to what options you have here. And notice that you can actually move this file over to Evernote, Dropbox, um, Team Viewer, or use Mover Lite to move it to another iOS device. So very easy, very um, intuitive. I'm going to click cancel here. And I'm going to click on the download icon here. Because one of the cool things is that you can take this file, download it. Um, notice that that was pretty fast. I'm going to, I'm going to click close here. And once it's on your device, you can then edit it and modify it. And perhaps if you're going on a plane or if you're going uh, to an international customer, um, you'll always have access to that file and you're not dependent on a 3G connection or Wi-Fi connection. I'm going to click on My Files here on the top to go back. And then I'm going to click on Downloads here at the bottom. And notice that my file that I downloaded is right there in the, uh, in the list. So now if I click on this file again, Voila, there is the file. So it's available to me. Uh, it's uh, very accessible. Notice that I'm on airplane, airplane mode now. So I have no connection, no Wi-Fi, no 3G connectivity or anything like that. And I, I can still access my connections files directly from my mobile device. And when you're done and you no longer need this file, you can actually take it and move it to the trash. So that's it. Pretty straightforward. Hope you liked it. And... Uh, if you want to learn more, you can find me at my blog, which is elbenitas.com. Thanks.